An intraarticular injection is an injection administered directly into a joint space. Intraarticular injections can be used for diagnostic or therapeutic purposes. As a diagnostic tool, it can be used in joints with a detectable effusion or in joints without a detectable effusion where you are unsure of the diagnosis. In these instances, you will aspirate and evaluate the synovial fluid. Alternatively, they can be used for relief of pain and inflammation in inflammatory arthritis such as rheumatoid arthritis, gout or spondyloarthritis, in non-inflammatory arthritis like osteoarthritis or non-articular conditions such as tendonitis or bursitis. This is a list of absolute and relative contraindications. If any of the absolute contraindications are present, the intraarticular injection should not be done. However, if any of the relative contraindications are present, your clinical judgment should guide your decision. Rheumatoid arthritis, rotator cuff tendonitis, and frozen shoulder are conditions of the shoulder that will typically require intraarticular injections. Lateral and medial epicondylitis and olecranon bursitis are conditions of the elbow for which you may consider intraarticular injection. Liquor tenosynovitis and carpal tunnel syndrome are common conditions of the wrist that may require intraarticular injections. Patients frequently present to primary care facilities with knee complaints. Osteoarthritis and rheumatoid arthritis are among the most common. These conditions, along with knee pain syndromes, are indications for intraarticular injections.